you will find disturbing one you probably don't want your kids to see. Spokane police trying to understand why someone would dissect a squirrel and display the carcass on a South Hill power pole. A woman walking her dog made that grisly discovery this morning just north of Rebecca and Congress in the Lincoln Heights area. KXY4 Jeff Humphrey joins us there now live. And Jeff, investigators concerned that this is more than just a case of high profile roadkill. Nadine, this poor little squirrel was cut open like someone had given it an autopsy. There were no obvious signs of other injuries like it had been run over by a car or shot. And given the way that it was tacked up on this power pole, police are worried that this incident may be something a lot more sinister than a late night prank. Six carefully placed nails spread out the squirrel in a bigger than life display intended to shock anyone who may see it. And we have a bunch of kids and they're just gonna if they happened onto it, they'd, it'd freak them out a little bit. Not only was a squirrel stretched out like a drying pelt, but someone had surgically removed all the skin on its belly. The culprit had put a lot of time into their ghoulish project. That took uh, some effort, some, um, some planning, and took some uh, significant steps to make it known what they planned on doing with the squirrels. Spokane police don't think graffiti on the pole makes this a gang-related incident. They are concerned that whoever did this to the squirrel has some serious mental issues that could lead to something worse. This is uh, could be a foretelling of something uh, a distant future where people could get hurt and um, yet this is extremely um, concerning to us. So now crime analysts are comparing this incident to any other reports of suspicious or sadistic activity in the area. Neighbors are watching their pets and children a little more carefully. And for the neighbors here, if you see something unusual, it's even more important for them to call in and, and then take care of their family, take care of their kids, take care of their pets, and do all those things that we do as good neighbors. And Nadine, that squirrel might still be here on display, except when the captain arrived on scene, he had taken the precaution of getting a hammer out of his desk, brought it here, took down the squirrel with the nails in it uh, before kids got out of school and had to see it. Reporting live on the South Hill, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.